Okay, first thing we're going to talk about is just the basic idea behind uh, which different type of shot we would take uh, depending on where we're receiving the pass. Uh, Johnny's my quarterback. If he gives me a good solid pass, I'm gonna, it's going to be a, a lot easier for me uh, to be able to rip a good shot. Uh, but sometimes it's too far in front, sometimes it's too far behind. Um, depending on what angle I'm receiving the pass from, it might want to be more of a wrist shot uh, or a bit of a snapshot. Or if I want to go uh, quite high, then it might make sense for me to drop down to one knee. So we're going to go over all those right now. The first thing is that my favorite shot is if I receive a pass in between my legs, then I can turn it into a nice snapshot. So if Johnny passes it, I can turn it into a quick, nice little snapshot. Essentially, the passer is aiming for my front heel. If he hits that spot or she hits that spot, then that's a perfect spot for me to get my arms in front of the puck and to be able to rip it and to properly transfer my weight and hit it in a nice, clean, that sort of sweet spot. Um, so there's two options in taking the snapshot. You can either be skating to the net on your one-time side and place your stick behind you and Johnny would make the pass in front. Go ahead and he aims for that that front heel and then you can make a nice hard snapshot from there uh, and then obviously our forward momentum is still skating towards the net but a lot of players like to pivot so now they can see both their passer quite easily and they can also see their net the only uh, common error that i see with this one is a lot of players pivot and they start heading towards the corner as opposed to actually heading towards the post and heading towards the net so that's what we want to do. We want to keep our momentum heading towards the net. If you do pivot, don't continue, go ahead John, skating backwards. Instead, I actually want you to pivot and head back to forwards. So if you do pivot, you receive the pass, pivot back to forwards as you're receiving that pass. Uh, so those are the key, key elements to taking a snapshot. Um, the louder the shot, the better. Uh, make sure that in order for it to be very accurate, it's obviously such a quick release. So my peripheral vision should be my main uh, asset for when I'm taking this shot. I'm looking, I'm looking at John, but as just before I'm receiving the pass, I'm using my peripheral vision, look in the corner of your eye and see what you've got. A lot of players will just receive it and then just take a basic shot on net and hope, hope that they'll actually hit the net. Us, we're gonna be a little bit more deliberate, so actually take a look, take a peek, and then as you're receiving that pass, you can take that shot and hopefully be a little bit more accurate with it.